Galen from EcoSchools Canada. For this Earth Day, I'm focusing on conserving water use at home while I'm washing dishes. And that means updating my system to use one clean bowl, some clean water, and just a few drops of soap to get it nice and sudsy, and only running the tap when I need to rinse. So far, it's working out pretty great. Happy Earth Day, everybody. For Earth Day, I'm gonna participate in a webinar about how to reduce microplastics in the environment from home. Hi, it's Ludivine from EcoSchools Canada. So for Earth Day, I will be planting this basil inside uh, so it can grow. And then when I can plant it outside, I will be able to enjoy um, my fresh basil. Happy Earth Day. Hi, my name is Jed Goldberg from Victoria, British Columbia. I was the president of Earth Day Canada from 1991 until I retired in 2014. This year marks the 50th anniversary of the first Earth Day an event that many consider to be the dawn of the modern environmental movement. This year is also the year of COVID-19, a devastating health crisis that has paralyzed the entire world. It has also shown us that people can follow the direction of experts and change their lifestyle very, very quickly to minimize the effect that the crisis has on them and others. It's my hope that this year we can apply that same level of perseverance and dedication and listen to what we've been hearing for decades. All the things that we can do to change our lifestyle to minimize our impact on the environmental crisis. It's time for us to give this crisis the attention it deserves. My name is Rachel Mitchell. I'm the climate change coordinator with the town of New Glasgow. This Earth Day, I pledge to ride my bike and walk more around town to reduce my carbon footprint. Hi, it's Lindsay from EcoSchools Canada. And for Earth Day this year, I'm committing to reducing food waste at home. That means only shopping for what I need and looking for creative ways to repurpose food scraps like these onions here. Happy Earth Day, everyone. Happy Earth Day, everyone. My name is Stephanie and I will store my used batteries in a non-metallic container safely until the local restrictions are lift and I can go visit a call to recycle drop-off location to recycle them. What about you? Hi, I'm Clara from EcoSchools Canada, and this Earth Day I'll be growing veggies for my garden to contribute to a more local diet and to spend some time outdoors. 